Hello everyone. In this video, I want to talk about how to create a table in AutoCAD 2021. So we can find the table tool in the annotation tab here. So click it. Now we are going to hold the menu to insert our table. Usually we need to decide decide the number of the column and the number of the rows. Here I selected the five and three. You can decide the number that you want. Sometimes we need to decide the column width and row height. So here's the scale, the preview of the scale. Actually, you can change a little bit from this area. We see that the first row is title, the second row is header. Here is for the data, data, data row. Look at here. Here the row that refer to the data row is not including the title and the header. Let's hit OK. Now I'm going to have the table. I can see it here. So I can move I can move it to decide where to put. So look at the first. You can look at the, the first corner on the top left to decide where to put. We are going to put it here. Okay. I want to close it because I already have it. Let's focus on this one. Click it. We click the table. Now we have the editor, editor on top. We have the insert and the delete. We can insert the road, insert above, insert below. We can also have the insert column, insert left and right. Now I select, select let's select this one. This cell, I want to insert a row above. Now I have a row above. Insert the row below, I have a row below. If I want to delete, make sure that I have to select the cell on this row and then delete the same for this cell above. Select a cell on this row and then delete. You can try to play how to insert and delete the column, which is the same to how to insert a row and delete a row. And look at here, we have a brush. It's like a format that we saw in the Excel or in the Word. So let's hit, I already selected this. Let's try to select this one. This one, we see that the text is left line. So let's, let's hit match cell. Now I want to select this one. You see that it's going to be left line. Same thing with the cell. It's going to be the same with the cell of this one. Let's try to do this one and then do this one. It's going to be left line. Okay. If we Right click, we are going to slow it. You can also change the style, how to align, align that. So you can, you can decide middle, center, left, and right. Make sure that you select that cell or select the cell that you want, want to apply. So we can also change the format of the data. Say I have the data here, file. So I may want to change it to the currency, let's see, it's going to have a dollar and two decimal. And change to date. This is not right. We can't do it. You can change the percent. Now it's gone. Let's type in. Uh type in and sorry. Percent now it's going to have a percent. Five percent. So let's return the back. Select general. You know, it already changed. I just want to return to back. So I have five. I have eight. Click it. Let's do it here. So I want to apply all. I want to use use the formula trying to calculate the summary. I want to calculate the average. Here actually 
I did the summary. So let's delete it, do it again. Delete it, select this, this cell, and apply it to the formula summary. Now I need to look at the command window. We need to see, select the first corner of the table, and then select the second corner of the table. Now we are going to have the C3 and D3. This is C3 and D3. And click somewhere else. Now we apply the formula right, to the cell that we get to now. This is kind of similar to the use cell. You can play, play it by yourself. Thank you very much for watching.